Welcome to this Destination Ulster session. Today we're going to talk to you about our biology and biomedical science courses. We hope you enjoy the session and decide to join us at Ulster University. So first of all, I will tell you a bit more about Ulster University. We have one of the largest UK universities spread across four campuses in Northern Ireland. Currently, we have approximately 26,000 students and growing. On the left, you can see our newly built Belfast campus, below our beautiful historic McGee campus and Jordanstown beside this, and on the top right are Coleraine campus, where you will be situated should you come to study biology or biomedical science at Ulster. Coleraine is in the northwest of Northern Ireland and off, this campus offers uh, modern and some newly built teaching facilities, a Riverside Theatre and our state-of-the-art sports complex. Coleraine is close to the seaside towns of Portrush and Port Stewart. So some of you might be familiar with these and it is an ideal location for outdoor uh, activity lovers, walking trails, beach activities, water sports, shopping and more. Ulster University is the number one university for student satisfaction, according to the 2020 um, National Student Survey. We are, and we are now one of the top five universities in the UK for biosciences, according to The Guardian 2020. So here you can see some of our teaching and learning facilities, from the large lecture theatres in the bottom left, to some of the smaller uh, breakout areas, the library, and our student working hubs as well. We also boast some state-of-the-art research facilities and with the recent research uh, excellence framework ranking us in the top five um, for research in biomedical sciences in the UK. Our research facilities include the Centre for Molecular Biosciences, CMB, on the top left photo, um, and also um, the SAD Centre for Pharmacy and Diabetes, both at the Coleraine campus. These have a large scope of sciences with leading experts in their fields where you will carry your, your final year um, dissertation project of your choice. Um, we also have another research facility at the Alt McGalvin Hospital site, the Clinical Translational Research and Innovation Centre. Several of your lecturers work from these buildings and you can undertake um, project work here too. So at UU we're focused upon work-based learning and preparing you for the working world. So in our steps to success we want you to understand why skills matter, build upon your skills evidence or profile while you're here with us and to share your story um, in like an e-portfolio. Um, in doing this, um, you will undertake placement opportunities, international opportunities and have tailored careers advice. You can even get an extra diploma at the end of your degree known as the Ulster Edge Award, um, which um, a large percentage of our graduates um, um, do. Um, we also um, have 94% of graduates from our courses in work or in further study after six months. So employers are key stakeholders um, at our university and we want to prepare you academically and personally as best possible to achieve the key skills and attributes you need for the working world at the end of your degree. So skills such as you can see here, um, analytical skills, organisational skills, problem solving, good verbal and digital communication, teamwork and more. Of course, uh, an important part of going to university is university life. And we want you to make friends, to learn new skills, both inter and extracurricularly, and most of all, to enjoy your time with us and have some fun. So our campus is situated, um, as we said, in Coleraine, but this is in the Belfast and Causeway coast, and this is ranked in the Lonely Planet um, number one region in the world to visit in 2018. And if you come here, um, you will see why. The cost of living um, is excellent. Um, it's of a high standard um, and it's affordable. Um, good local and on-campus accommodation, um, good transport and amenities nearby. We also boast a large variety of clubs and societies uh, run by our students. And um, these are um, run as part of the UUSU Students' Union. So we have um, many for those that are adventurous, such as surfing, rowing, um, and other sports. We have Irish dancing, debating, and lots more. So there really is something for everyone. So um, today we're going to cover why you should study with us at Ulster. And, and in particular for biology and biomedical science. What you will learn, how you will be taught, how we will support you, 
and you can even hear what some of our students think and importantly what future careers you might want to progress into after your course. So uh, firstly, my name is Dr. Rachel Irwin and I'm the course director for the BSc Honours Biology course at the Coleraine campus for Ulster University. So as a biologist, you will study life, living organisms and their relationships with their environments. And in the current world with ongoing topical issues in the news, biology is becoming an advancing and increasingly important and popular area of study. So uh, on our course, we'll provide you um, with personalised teaching support, so such as one to one mentoring, small seminar groups, and we will have career sessions built into your timetable as well. Um, you will um, have a personal dissertation as supervisor in your final year. Uh, we both taught class facilities and teaching spaces for you to learn the skills you require in and out of the laboratory or fieldwork. And then uh, importantly as well, we have industry um, supported um, prizes or sponsored prizes um, from several industrial partners, which you can feel of. And this is a really brilliant opportunity to showcase your high achievements to employers and to the university. Um, you also get a certificate and, and a monetary prize as well. Um, and as a biology student, you're eligible for affiliate membership of the prestigious uh, Royal Society of Biology, which in itself has many benefits. So whether you choose our three year or four year undergraduate degree program, the biology course covers core areas such as biomedical, molecular and environmental sciences. And you will learn about uh, plant and animal physiology, human physiology, veterinary biology, chemistry, biochemistry, as well as cell biology. You'll also learn about specific projects that are important, such as the Human Genome Project and its impact on advances in molecular genetics and genetic defects and human diseases. You will also learn about ecology and biodiversity within a global setting. So the three year degree programme in biology offers three years of taught and practical work Whereas the four year program um, offers the same, but with a placement year, which you can take of your choice between year two and final year. And we really do encourage that. So you can build upon the skills you need for your working um, life as well. We have an integrated master's program at the end of your study, which you can avail of should you wish. And this enables study abroad um, in the US. So in your first year, um, you concentrate on the fundamentals of biology and learning about those. This includes field trips to the Giants Causeway and more. And then in year two, um, you will learn about the processes and the skills you need um, for your career. So this includes hands on um, computer labs and laboratory experience as well. You then can choose to go on a placement year um, where you will choose from a variety of areas in biology or biological um, study. Um, these include um, the National Trust, for example, Randox, um, teaching in schools and more. And in final year, you will begin to apply the knowledge that you've learnt and start shaping your career path, getting ready for, for going into either further study or into the world of work. Um, and this will include um, your choice of a final year dissertation research project as well. So in biology, we teach in a number of ways. Um, we like to be quite hands-on and practical. So you will have lectures, computer labs, um, uh, field trips, and more. Um, the course itself is a full-time course. We do expect eight hours of work each day, and 40% of this um, study time is at face-to-face -face, um, teaching sessions. Um, the rest um, is your own self-directed work. Uh, you will be provided with personal study support. So this will include having a, you know, a year tutor, so a member of staff who um, you can go to um, with any issues or any help that you need. Um, we have our peer mentoring scheme known as PASS, where the year above will help to mentor um, the, the newcomers when they come in with anything um, academically or pastorally. Um, class reps, um, and online resources as well. So all of your notes um, will be online for you to avail of um, and other resources such as the library. You'll be taught in uh, group work and individual work as well. So sometimes you'll be working on your own and sometimes you'll be working as a team. Um, you will be assessed um, via exams and coursework um, throughout um, your degree and um, we try to take a blended learning approach as well. 
Just in terms of how we support you, I've covered some of this already, but we do have an open door policy. Um, we have, of course, large lecture theatres um, and large classes, but we also have um, small class sizes too, which is a nice thing at Coleraine where we can give real one-to-one -one mentorship. Um, we have career sessions that are tailored to you for what you want to do built into our career. And there are also a wide range of um, student support services available outside of the course itself, but at the university. So um, in terms of testimonials from some of our students, um, Jack Kelly here was one of our final year students and um, he really enjoyed the course and he, because he always had an interest at school um, and what he wanted to do was a PGCE once he graduated. Um, he really enjoyed um, the edge accredited activities um, such as the peer mentoring scheme, which he was a mentee in year one and in year two he was a past mentor. Another one of our students, Aileen, um, who's also in her final year, um, she had a real interest in um, her A-level biology and in particular human physiology and anatomy. Um, but then as she progressed through her, her degree, she realised that she really enjoyed marine biology and chose to do her research project in that and then to hopefully pursue a PhD um, at Ulster University. Um, so she enjoyed the wide range of topics um, in on the biology course as well and these helped her, her to evolve as a person as she went through and decide what she wanted to do. Um, so as I said you can undertake a, a work placement year which you really do encourage for uh, real world experience and some examples of um, what our students have done during this year out um, have been teaching in primary schools um, even abroad in the likes of Spain um, working at ALMAC and Randox in industrial placements, either in research and development or in a laboratory-based setting elsewhere. Um, research facility places here um, at some of our research facilities that I showed you earlier at Ulster University, and also some scientific marketing placements too. There are many others. Um, and really the highlights of taking a placement year is that um, statistically you're um, more likely to achieve a higher final degree classification professional network and you also obtain um, an extra diploma upon graduating as well. So this could be you. Um, we're quite an interactive um, course and um, this is an insight into some of our um, events that we do. Um, here you can see um, we go to schools like in the top left here um, for um, biology week and we were teaching um, primary school children about um, digestion using chocolate cake. Um, we also um, have attended um, the air show, um, the cornfield where we teach children about native and non-native plants and recycling and there are just many many others. We have a formal at the end of each year you can see in the bottom left and some table quizzes um, and things like that to help you meet friends and, and get together. So biology graduates are in high demand for their technical and professional skills and really what our employers want is accredited, recognised qualifications, people with practical experience that can solve practical problems and apply their knowledge to different types of skills, um, people who can work independently um, or as part of a team and people who are good at communicating and articulating um, their ideas both um, in person and becoming more important digitally, digitally as well. So in terms of future careers, um, biology graduates are in demand and it's an area of increasing interest for many um, with the life sciences employment area set to increase by 12% and this makes you highly employable in the life science sector um, for jobs in Northern Ireland. Um, one of the directors from AFBI in Northern Ireland um, had noted uh, how important um, this sector was during the pandemic and um, how important public and private enterprises are and having a positive impact on people's lives and looking at the bigger picture, just noting that the sector really is flourishing. So um, some of our graduates have gone into um, well, many different careers and these are some examples on the right hand side. So if you do the biology course, there um, are a real diversity of careers you can go into and this is a real unique selling point in that you know um, you have this diversity um, of careers and you're not pigeonholed down one pathway. So here um, you can see some of the examples where people have gone into public health or applied research and um, perhaps in further study and um, biotechnology, forensic science, politics, business and um, bioinformatics, scientific writing communication, 
art, media and marketing, um, environmental management and conservation, and also um, education, so in museums, um, higher education um, and schools as well. One of our graduates, Chloe here, um, graduated um, in 2019 and has gone from strength to strength. Um, she really enjoyed the variety of modules um, that the, the, the biology programme gave her um, and the skills that she learnt, um, the practical skills allowed her to go on and um, work at Van Docks, um, where she very quickly became a senior scientist um, since she started there. Our employers, such as the managing director, um, Peter Fitzgerald of Van Docks, um, it was very complimentary um, in one of his statements he made about students. You can see here from our courses, and um, he really says um, that they have um, the ability to improve lives and quality of life for all of the world's citizens um, and they have their own positive mark on the world. Um, so I'm going to hand you over here to Dr Valerie Hinch, she's the course director for Biomedical Sciences. Hello, so my name is Dr Valerie Hinch and as Rachel has said I'm the course director for the Biomedical Science programmes here at Ulster University in Coleraine. Now, some of you might be aware of what biomedical science is, some of you may not, so I'm just going to give you a brief overview first of all. So biomedical science really focuses on human disease and the term biomedical scientist is actually a profession. They are the National Health Service frontline workers basically and what they do is they test human samples in our pharmaceutical companies where they're continuously researching or developing vaccines for example. Um, or in hospitals where they are diagnosing patients with suspected diseases. And biomedical sciences, scientists play an immense role in our health service. And really, without them, well, there would be so many more ill people in the world today. Now, it's known actually that biomedical scientists diagnose more than 80% of all known diseases. So you yourself, can be one of these biomedical scientists and we at Ulster University can certainly prepare you for that. So why Ulster University? Well, firstly, all our biomedical science uh, programmes here are approved by accredited bodies such as that of the IBMS, the Institute of Biomedical Science, and the HCPC, the Health and Care Professions Council. And not every university has accredited biomedical science programmes, so this is really quite unique to us. We are also very unique in the sense that we are the only university in Northern Ireland which provides a placement year in biomedical science. And this is something that we feel is very important because a placement year really does help with employability. And this really is our focus. So what we do is we work closely with our employability and our careers department, as Dr. Irwin has specified, just to ensure that we are able to provide our students with the best possible support that we can so that they can develop those lifelong skills that employers really do need. And then they are work-based ready. This then leads our students to be being very successful in terms of getting their jobs. And as you can see here, we had 100% of our students successfully gaining employment over the past couple of years. And indeed, this is actually a very healthy 35% above the UK average. Not only that, we are also unique because we had an overall student satisfaction rate, which I'm pleased to say was 100% uh, in 2021 and indeed it was also the top course for students satisfaction rating within the university itself. We also have uh, received, uh, achieved academic excellence awards which really does reflect then that of the commitment and the dedication of all our staff in really delivering that exceptional student experience. So what programmes do we provide? within our biomedical science programmes. We have three. We have biomedical science with diploma in pathology. And then we have biomedical science with a diploma in industrial studies. So both of these courses involve placement year and that occurs in year three. Now the pathology programme, it really focuses on working um, if you wanted to work in a hospital laboratory, for example. While if on the other hand, you would like to broaden your options, 
the industrial program, it tends to focus on placement in industry, say, such as pharmaceutical companies, uh, teaching, etc. And some students actually stay within our university and carry out scientific research. Others head across the water, as Dr. Irwin had also specified, to countries like Spain, like Germany, and even America. So the three-year programme, while it offers no placement, it still continues to offer those similar career options. And indeed, our course can also act as a basis for those of the students who perhaps would like to continue with further education and study medicine, such as our new medical uh, degree programme uh, at McGee campus. And this actually has been in favour of um, with a lot of our students over the past year or so. Regardless of which programme that you do choose, all three courses still provide the same subjects and the skills and the expert teaching that employers do need today. So just to give you an example of some of those subjects that you would study within biomedical science. Because biomedical science, as I previously stated, um, is all to do with human disease, you would then focus on subjects such as anatomy and physiology, microbiology, genetics, hematology and blood transfusion, cell pathology, and so on. And in terms of our teaching and learning practice, we would have, um, we provide large lecture classes, small group tutorials, seminars, all with assessments and examinations. And indeed, for every lecture that a student has, they will have an associated uh, practical class. And the students really like this because they can then reflect on the theory and then they can put it into practice, just as they would do in the real world of biomedical science. So there is a good variety um, for the student experience. And indeed, you know, many of our modules are supported by clinicians who come in from the health and social care trusts to help teach as well. And again, the students like to see that current practice being reflected upon. Uh, to give you an example of what you might study, say, in one of the cell pathology practical classes, <clears throat> you might uh, perhaps investigate the journey of an organ, such as here, as you can see, a diseased kidney. And so in this particular practical class, it would be your role to apply all the biomedical science skills and theory that you have learnt to investigate and diagnose this kidney or the associated patient. So this is just one you know, of our many opportunities that um, you would experience. So let's meet some of our biomedical science students and their thoughts on the courses. Here we have Lucia. Now Lucia um, is now uh, in third year and uh, Le uh, Lucia actually joined into her second year after a foundation degree course and she at the same time worked as a healthcare assistant in the cell pathology laboratory in the Royal Victoria Hospital. And she was then given the opportunity to continue her placement year within this specific laboratory. And Lucia quotes here, her reason for studying biomedical science at Ulster University was, Ulster University was my first choice due to a high student satisfaction rate and recommendations by my biomedical science colleagues within the Belfast Trust. Now, once Lucia completes her placement, she's in the pathology course, uh, she will then have her registration portfolio completed and this will enable her then to become a fully registered biomedical scientist and then register with the HCPC ready for employment. We also have Rebecca. Rebecca joined the industrial programme and this allowed her to carry out her placement in Randox Pharmaceuticals and what really attracted Rebecca again to the course was as she specified the, the ability to also be able to take a placement year to help her then with employability opportunities after she graduates. And then finally, we have Rachel. Rachel, she was again in the pathology course. She also won um, the President's Prize for the highest mark in final year and has since graduated. And she used her biomedical science degree and her experience to continue her studies in medicine. 
So we have lots of biomedical scientists all graduating and working not only in Northern Ireland, but throughout the world in our hospital laboratories, in our forensic science laboratories, in our pharmaceuticals, research within our universities and many more. And um, many now are in fact in management, senior team leadership, consultants, doctors, etc. So loads of opportunities. We work closely with our employers throughout the year uh, in Northern Ireland, and they really do value our programmes and our students. And we have Dr. Uh, Ryan Graydon here from the Ulster Hospital, and he specifies Ulster University students entering placement do so with a sound knowledge and practical experience. And without them, there would be a struggle in providing the required patient care. So our graduates are, as you can see here, indeed in high demand. You can see here some of our graduates actually within the Northern, uh, with the Northern Ireland IBMS chair, the Institute of Biomedical Science chair upon graduation. And so indeed, you could be one of these graduates too. We do feel it is uh, very important for our students while they're studying and studying hard to be happy and to gain those skills as much as possible that our employers want. You know, those the communication skills, the professional relationship skills. And so we also provide lots of opportunities for them to do that and to participate in things like open days, world awareness days. And indeed, many of you might have already seen us in social media pages. And when doing this, uh, they too can also gain awards from such activities, again, to help with their employability, to help strengthen their CVs, their references, etc. And you know, each student is an award winner in our eyes. And what is so lovely is to actually see our students flourish into those happy, dedicated young biomedical scientists and be so successful in their careers. So that in mind, if um, you would like to know all about or more about biomedical science at Ulster University, we would first of all be, be delighted to see you here. If you'd like to get a taster, um, I would encourage you to enter some of the platforms which are spe specified here. In addition to that, we have taster programmes, which um, please feel free to experience these at the above addresses. Many pupils actually love these in schools because it gives them a sense of um, not only experience, but at the very end of it, they can receive a certificate once complete. And this then will enhance their personal statements, their CVs, etc. And it really does give them confidence to continue in the, um, the world of biomedical science after they complete these. So every little bit actually helps and will make you stand out above the rest. Just to note, um, with all our courses for biology, summarizing for our biomedical science in summary, and the biomedical science program with pathology in summary, I would encourage you just to keep up to date with these current programs as they are continuously updated uh, from year to year. And if you have any queries, please contact the admissions um, and you can see here at admissions at ulster.ac.uk. So um, we would love to see you on our biology or biomedical science programs um, and provide for you the experience that we feel that you deserve and that you would most certainly enjoy. Thank you for listening.